Okay, it's Saturday. I just got home from a fashion show and uh, I should be studying for my French test, but I'm slacking because I just want to relax. So I thought I'd film a video. This has no focus in particular, but I thought I would just do sort of a life chat, let you know what I'm up to today and what I'm up to in general. And yeah, let me know if you guys like these sorts of videos. I think it's a really nice way to connect with you guys and show that I'm a real human being. <laughs> so yeah, let me know if you like this. It's not gonna be anything too interesting probably. Anyways, I'm gonna make a cup of tea, so yeah. Anyways, as most of you guys, I'm gonna turn on a light here. Probably gonna make the lighting funny, but as you guys already know, I am a fashion blogger and beauty blogger, so I thought I'd start off by showing you some of the stuff that I got this week to feature on the blog and on Instagram. Sorry for the noise. And um, show you a few things that I picked up over the week also, like beauty products that I really like, and um, some other stuff. And yeah, nothing too major. So tonight I am going to the ballet. I partnered up with the National Art Center. I have been collaborating with them on and off for like a year. So I'm gonna go see the Nijinsky Ballet tonight because I'm so fancy. And uh, I think I will wear this blazer I got from Zara while in Barcelona but I'm also not feeling it. I'm not sure. I'm going to try it on. You guys let me know what you think. I don't know. Yeah. So this is the blazer. I know it's cute. It's black velvet. It's got all this fabulous embroidery, but I feel like it makes me look like a football player. It's got these shoulder pads that are a little out of control. I'm not wearing the greatest like clothing underneath it. I'm wearing like this thick heavy sweater, but I don't know. Like I find blazers are hard. I don't want to look like my mom. Not that my mom looks bad, <laughs> but I just think it's, it's too like, I don't know, fancy football player. I'm not feeling it. I'll pick something else. All right. So that's the blazer. I'll show you other stuff that, um, I got this week. This lighting is so bad. All right, so yeah, I'm at the front of the house. Um, okay, I'm gonna show you what I got. Some goodies from Shepherds. That was the fashion show that I was in this morning, the fashion shows. And uh, I'll show you some other stuff that I got, some goodies. Uh, it was my birthday about a month ago. And yeah, I'll show you what I got for that. Um, let's see, countertop's not dry. Okay, I'm gonna wipe it down. Uh, I gotta get this outfit ready for tonight. So I'm kind of stressing about that. The ballets are always kind of fancy, so I don't know. I guess I'll just do a dress. But this is what I got for my birthday. It's a Louis Vuitton carry-all. I've wanted one of these forever. I got it pre-loved from Fashion File. And uh, it's a perfect carry-on. I love it. So I've been using this for shoots, actually, <laughs> to carry all of my clothes. I used it um, today for the fashion show, and it holds so much. I don't know if you guys can see that. Turn on the light. Yeah, like, I've got a makeup bag, sunglasses, and just a ton of clothes. It's pretty awesome. Um, I'm so happy, because this... This bag retails for like, I think it's $2,020, and I got it for a fifth that, and it's um, very, very good condition. Yeah, so I'm pretty happy with that. Um, show you what else I got. This is all the blogger stuff that I got this week. Um, well, over the past two weeks, I should say. Uh, I'm actually, I'm gonna show you guys this. Um, I got some stuff from Pixie, and this looks beautiful. I've been um, reading the reviews and it seems like it's pretty good. So I'm going to start with this. I hope I'm not getting to Blair Witch Project on you guys, so I will stop moving the camera around. But I got this cute little bag. I'm obsessed with Gucci and want to save my pennies because I want to go away in a couple of months. And so, um, yeah, I'm just going to move the tag here. 
So actually this was um, given to me for the fashion show today. Oh my God, I'm having so much trouble with this. It's very cute, I love the ribbon. It's so adorable, it, it looks very much like Gucci. I am not one for knockoffs, but free cute bag. Can't say no. I'm gonna take this sweater off. I am sweating. Give me two seconds. All right, Whew, that's better. I think I'm gonna sit down. Um, yeah, let's see. So I wanna show you the rest of this stuff. All my tea is ready. It's all happening all at once. Get the pixie stuff. Um, yeah, God, I wish this house was brighter. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna let that steep for a bit. Okay, <laughs> we're set, finally. All right, so you guys know I love Delphine. I know it's expensive, you guys keep telling me this. So just so you guys know, I've started this new thing. Um, every Saturday morning at 11, I try to do a Facebook Live video on the best beauty products or hair care products or whatever that I've discovered or you know just that I like and have been using forever and want to show with you guys and it's gotten great response some great uptake so uh, I'm gonna continue doing that um, I'm, I'm gonna get my tea hold on time okay so um, the skincare video was the last one I did did super well I'm really happy with how that's going a bunch of you are asking me to do a makeup video I'm gonna admit I don't like doing makeup videos because I don't know what I'm doing and um, I'm not frankly like I love makeup but I just I wear the same colors over and over again so See, like I always wear like a mauve pink eyeshadow and mauve pink lips and I love a cat eye and that is the extent of my makeup, but a ton of you asked for a makeup video. So I guess I will, I'll do one. You guys also wanted a hair care update video. Hair is doing very well. I will get on that also. So yeah, um, I never run out of this stuff. It's uh, Delphin Lumiere Essentielle. Skin cream, it is the bomb. It is crazy expensive, I know. It's 100, it was $104 Canadian, but it has transformed my skin. Ooh, the sun is coming out. It's getting pretty bright and shadowy. So, I think, I'm just gonna power through this, because I know I'm getting annoying. So, um, my lips were a mess. Um, my lips get super chapped every winter. The cold conditions, it gets super dry out, and um, I went to Sephora and I got this First Aid Beauty Ultra Repair Intensive Lip Balm because my girlfriend is like, this stuff's so good, you need to try it. I hate it. It is shea butter based. It smells like wintergreen, like minty lifesavers. And um, because it's shea butter based, if it gets cold, it is like rubbing a candle across your lips. It's so waxy and so hard, and it's also grainy. It's got the grossest texture. And, um, but what I've started doing was keeping it in my pocket so it heats up a bit. And when it's heated up a bit, it goes on way better. It has a much nicer texture. So it was $25, and I'm not, I'm not altogether happy with this. I, this is, I would never buy this again. Boo. So I got this Delphin lip balm instead. Um, this stuff was so expensive. You'd have to remortgage the house for it, but it's really, really nice and it smells way better. It smells like fruity, I'm not quite sure, but it's nice and soft and it has a lovely texture and it makes your lips feel instantly better. My lips were getting really chapped and really painful. I'm way happier with this. Okay, so next up, I got a ton of skincare, but I'm gonna just do um, blog posts on that stuff. So check out my blog at styledomination.com and you guys can see the reviews. Um, it's not all Delphine, it's uh, different products. 
all good. I only review stuff on the blog that I really like and that I would buy myself. Okay, so here's the Pixie Beauty box. Um, and this is all rose stuff. Look at this, it's so pretty. See, it's like a book and you can open it up. And uh, what are these? So we've got Rose Caviar Essence. Ooh, um, after, what is this? I don't even know what it is. It's a serum and it looks super pretty. It's got like um, rose petals in it. I'm trying to get it out of the box here. It's like fused into the box. And we also have a Rose Flash Balm. I'm excited to try this. Instant Skin Booster. A little bit there. Ooh, it's nice and thick. Smells incredible. Ooh, that smells like rose. It's fabulous. So I think you can get Pixie Beauty at like Shoppers Drug Mart here in Canada. So like the better drug stores. So this is a three-in-one moisturizer, primer, and mask. Here, that's what it looks like. And I don't know if you can see, the lighting is so bad, the rose petals, or it's like little pink things floating in it. But yeah, so that's that. And then, I'm super excited about this, the um, matte liquid lip lipsticks. Oh, and they're all like, they're all like super Dominique shades. <laughs> so, all mauves. <laughs> okay, so we have Eau Naturel, beautiful pinky nude. And then we have um, Pastel Petal. You can see that. And then Matte Beige. I think this will definitely be too light. But really rose. Looks like it's totally up my alley. I love these colors. They're generally all I wear. And evening rose. So I think I'm actually going to wear this tonight to the ballet. I'm going to try to get it out here. That's like a nice dark. Let's try it out. Okay. Oh, it's a little light. I don't know, it's not bad. I think I can work with it. Get the old uh, MAC chestnut lip liner and fix it up a bit. It's not too bad. I don't know. The rest are lighter than this though, so oof, I don't know. I have to let it sit. I have to think about it. <laughs> so yeah, that is it for today. Um, I really wanted to get out of the house today, but the fashion shows ran a little late, so I am going to keep doing these short little ones. I think they'd be fun, and uh, yeah, I will see you in the next one. Bye for now.